Okay, I'm going to go over a little bit on how I generate some ideas for my sculpts. I use a program called Alchemy, which is free. So within this program right here, you can choose options like Mirror, which allows me to sketch vector style within this program. And as you can see, I can create random shapes, nice clean images, and get very designed. And the nice thing about this program is, is that there is no undo. So you really have to focus on what you see at that time. Just really focus on the overall silhouette of something. So like already I can kind of see, I can see shoulders and a head, or I can see a really um, unique headdress. You just, you just kind of keep making these shapes until you see something that you like, and then you take it into Photoshop and do a quick sketch on top before you go into ZBrush. Sometimes these are good enough to just kind of go in and start designing something immediately. So like right away I can already kind of see a unique helmet and shoulder design. This is just a good way to kind of start and kind of break out of your habits that you always have. As artists, there's always those certain things that we like and we tend to go after every time we start something. By doing this sketching, it really opens up your imagination into things that you didn't see before. The cool thing is, is that like an another artist could come by and see this silhouette and think of something completely different. And so this right here is something I could start from. Export, save it to desktop. We're going to keep going here and just show you a little bit more. Sketch here and see what I can think of here. So here I can also go in here and switch the color, change the transparency, and go in here and maybe figure out where I want the eyes to go for a creature. Maybe I want some shapes in here. It's almost like value painting. Just going around here, just seeing what I may want to do here. I might switch this back. So now I'm just kind of filling in this gray area. So already you can see I've, I've got a pretty decent idea of, of where I'm going to take this sculpt and, and overall design. Okay, we're going to clear this. We're going to do another one. Because what I do after this is I will kit bash from my own thumbnails and make many different thumbnails to choose from. Okay, we're going to copy this guy over. And we're going to grab this guy here. You know what? We're going to grab these little brush strokes. We can use these too. How I'm going to do this is I'm going to do a lot of like, special selecting where you do Control and Shift, and then when you, when you hit Control Shift Copy, it'll copy everything uh, underneath the layer. Okay, so let's start with this one right here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab from this guy, move that up, and duplicate that. I'm going to flip it horizontally. Just kind of move that in place. Let's grab this section here. Here I am just warping this already little vector sample. Now let's go ahead and duplicate that. Warp it. So those last two ones I did, I'm going to merge together and then I'm going to duplicate them and I'm going to transform them and flip them over here. So you guys can already see how quickly you can come up with different thumbnails just based on what you got out of Alchemy. So I like these two that I just created. We're going to duplicate those. We're going to move these over here. So I'm going to warp these. 